Welcome back once again to howtocookgreatfood.com. If you haven't already, please click that button and subscribe to our channel. Also, please do take time to click that bell icon just below for notifications. On the menu today, and as you can see here, we're gonna do some fried rice, mushroom and cauliflower fried rice with some beautiful Indian style flavors. It's very, very simple, healthy, veggie, and vegan. Let's go and take a look at the ingredients we need. Okay, let's take a look at these ingredients. So we've got rice, obviously. Now I've got basmati rice cooked. Always use cold rice when you're making any type of fried rice. Hot or warm rice just doesn't work out so well, so make sure it's nice and cold. Cauliflower, my cauliflower, I've already semi-cooked this, so I've just sort of blanched it for a couple of minutes. So 50% cooked, fresh white mushrooms, chopped onion, fresh green chili, garlic ginger paste, there's like a tablespoon there, fresh coriander or cilantro, and then if you wanted, you could use some curry powder. I've got four separate powders there, which I always call the big four, half a teaspoon, cumin, coriander, chili, and turmeric. We're gonna start us off with some oil. That's about it, very simple. Let's go and do it. Okay, so I've got my large wok on the go today. In there I've got some sunflower oil. I forgot to mention these, which are our fennel seeds, which is a massive flavor in this. I really love these in this rice. If you wanted, you could be using cumin or something like that, but these are beautifully fragrant, so I'm gonna go for these. So in they go into the hot oil. And then we're gonna add that onion, and then we're gonna go high heat just for like two minutes. Wonderful. These fennel seeds really, really do have a fantastic taste and aroma. Let's now go in with those mushrooms and our cauliflower, which like I say, I've just half cooked. And again, another couple of minutes, keep it moving. Super. Now we're gonna add in our fresh chili, our garlic ginger paste, and our powders, let me just talk to you about them again. Chili, cumin, turmeric, and coriander. If you want, you can just use a curry powder of your choice. Okay, one to two minutes, keep this moving all the time now, because once the garlic ginger paste goes in, it can burn quite easily, so really keep this moving. Okay, now time to add the cold cooked rice. Three to four minutes on this very high heat. Keep this moving around. We want to cook the rice, not just mix it. So it needs, like I say, three to four minutes. If we get a little bit of browning or blackening on the rice, for me, that's fantastic. We're very nearly done. Just gonna pop a little bit of salt into the mix. We're gonna add our chopped coriander or cilantro. We're gonna turn off the heat. We're gonna give this one final mix. And this wonderful mushroom cauliflower fried rice is done. Hope you enjoy that. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. We'll see you soon. Lots of love.